all REPLs now have a fantastic new Git interface that you can use to really supercharge your workflow. Let's take a look at it today and see exactly what we can do from within any REPL. Now you'll find the Git pane in the tools options where it'll pop up on the right hand side and you can simply click the button to initialize a Git repository and that happens locally to the REPL straight away which is fantastic. When you make changes as usual you can make commits when you get to the point that you want to make a commit this is really really easy including adding the commit message and we can even make small changes that we can stage individual files or simply reset them and cancel commits. Creating new branches is as simple as clicking create branch and giving it a name. We can then move between the branches really, really easily if we need to, commit into any of the branches at any time, and switching between branches also changes all the files instantly. This makes working with Git so much easier and so much quicker than it ever has been. Let's connect it to GitHub and see just how we can work with remote repos. Clicking the settings icon, and then connecting to GitHub gives you the ability to connect it. I'm going to give it access to all my repos and immediately I can pick GitHub and I can create a repository. Now I can publish my branches straight to my remote GitHub repo. Of course, with it connected to GitHub, that means if changes happen remotely or from a different user that are, that are pushed to the branch that I'm working on, I can see those and I can pull them back in and synchronize the content so I can see everything that's going on. But what happens if we cause a conflict? Well, let's take a look. Ah, well, warning straight away and blocks our ability to push. So let's pull down the commit and see how we're going to deal with that. And you can see it shows the conflicts. It shows the two versions of the code that have appeared and we can tidy that up and fix that ourselves. Removing the metadata will allow us to complete the pull. If we're not happy or if we don't know how to sort that out, we can abort the pull until we get to chat to our fellow devs. Of course, the best way to work on Repl is with multiplayer, and that works wonderfully with this Git integration too. So you can actually work live on the same files in the same branch at the same time and see exactly what each other are doing. Now, this works beautifully with our recently updated Git in the shell integration. So if I put up a shell tab, you can see that I can push directly from the shell and we can see the changes appear in our UI straight away. If I attempt to commit, you'll see here that I don't actually have a commit message yet. So Replic can now automatically open a pane and let us edit the commit message. Once edited, we can try that again. And you'll see that although we're doing the commit in the shell, the changes are reflected instantly in the UI. It's even really easy to check that out and push it back up to GitHub without a massive issue. And of course, all this is available in our mobile app, meaning that you can create, initialize, push, commit, and deal with conflicts on Git on the go. This makes it invaluable. Our new Git integration is fantastic and completely fully featured. It allows those of you that are pro developers that work with Git day to day, and even those of us that use Git for independent projects to work seamlessly in a way that we're familiar with, whilst getting all the benefits of the Repl experience. Why don't you go and give our new GitHub integration a go? Because it is fantastic.